what is happening guys welcome back to my channel Kelechi here okay so in today's video I will be talking about this big boy this is my everyday gadget this is the Infinix InBook X1 Pro laptop what do you think let's talk about it okay so the first thought that comes into your mind when you see this laptop for the first time is what is the price of this laptop? How much is it worth? And then the second thing that should probably set in your mind is what are the specs? What is the spec of this laptop? Is it efficient enough to carry out whatever task you have? I've had this laptop for quite a while now and it has been my daily driver. And I've tested the speed, the efficiency, the performance and also the durability. And this is the first laptop from Infinix. They did a very good job here. They're not just a smartphone company. They also make good laptops. So going forward, maybe in the future we're going to see Infinix cars. So this laptop is priced around $540 and that's about 300000 in Naira. And what you get for the price? In terms of design, the first thing that struck me about this laptop from the first day is the color. Of course, this is very attention grabbing. You don't get to see so many others like this. This color brightens my day each time I look at it or even before I touch it. Infinix opted for a sleek stylish design on this laptop. And you have other color options like the green and the red. This one has a two-tone metal finish that gives it a distinctive look. This is the Star 4 gray color. There is also the elegant color. This laptop is nothing like a regular notebook. The design is up to standard with aluminum finish and it weighs exactly 1.48 kg. Very thin and premium. The hinge mechanism offers a 180 degree movement. It is solid and does not allow the lid to wobble or shake easily. Infinix also provided a small cutout on the lid, so you can open the laptop with ease. It's not possible to open with one hand. On opening the laptop, you have a similar color theme that goes all the way to the keyboard dock. Very impressive. On the keyboard, there is no numpad or extra keys. The trackpad is wide and responsive. It clicks fast and registers quickly. The best part of using this laptop is the keyboard. It has a snappy feel to it and very comfortable typing. I'm impressed with the backlighting and that's something you don't get to see on most budget laptops. There is also the fingerprint unlocking that gives you instant access to your data. You can also safeguard your data as well. This laptop sports a 14 inch full HD display. It is an IPS display with a resolution of 1920 by 1080 pixels. A resolution that refreshes at 60 Hz and has a topping out brightness of 300 nits. It also offers a ratio of 16 to 9 aspect ratio. And it is surrounded with thin bezels around and a thick bezel at the bottom. I love this laptop display, it works well for me, but it's not really ideal outside. My overall experience with the display of this laptop is okay, although it is not very punchy, but it is impressive. And you can fold the screen all the way to the back, and that's a plus if you're watching Netflix on your bed or probably watching a movie or watching YouTube videos. And yes, the sound quality, it is fairly decent and also loud. The stereo separation is okay and there is also bass in the mix. Okay, maybe you should tell me what you think. You have front facing speakers that is powered by DTS. And also underneath you have the speaker grill and the vent for heat dissipation. This laptop comes in an ice storm cooling system. And Infinix confirms it is to cool the device during extreme usage and it works automatically. So other external features include two USB-C ports on the left for data transfer. But one of the ports is to charge the laptop. And also Infinix provided a separate DC in charging port. That's in case you don't want to use the other USB port. Then you also have the HDMI port and USB 3.0 port. And then on the right side you get a USB 3.0 port, a USB 2.0 port. A 3.5 mm headphone jack. There is also an included SD card reader port. You don't have the Ethernet port here, but this laptop comes with Wi Fi 6 and coupled with the Bluetooth 5.1 for extremely fast internet and transfers. There is also a 720p webcam on this laptop and a microphone affixed next to the webcam. Another impressive feature of this laptop is the battery. It comes with a very good battery life that delivered up to 10 hours in my usage time. It packs a 55 watts battery capacity and takes less than an hour to fully charge to 100%. The biggest and perhaps the most important factor anyone would definitely be interested in getting a laptop is the overall performance. 
and a good laptop should be able to perform very well without making a hole in your pocket. And that's what the Infinix InBook X1 Pro offers. This is the 10th generation Intel Core i7 processor that is clocked at a max speed of 3.90 GHz with an Intel Iris Plus graphics. I have a 16 GB of RAM here with a 512 GB SSD memory. The specs of this laptop is already a good call to super performance and is able to carry out whatever task you throw at it on a daily basis. This laptop is good for beginners and also demanding professionals. Okay guys, please let me know the laptop you're using right now, your current laptop, please let me know in the comment below. And also if you're looking to upgrade to the Infinix InBook X1 Pro. So guys, in conclusion, I would say that this is a do-everything laptop and it is okay. At 300,000 naira or 540 US dollars, it's definitely a good budget laptop. Please let me know what you think in the comments below and please, on your way out, hit on every subscribe button. Thank you so much guys for watching this video. Kelechi Yoka and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.